Hello homies, it's your homegirl Natalie and welcome to today's video. Here is LB. Kevin actually left today. LB, are you sad? Cause Kevin left? Little Kevin? He's like, no. Nah, you loved him. But anyway, so for today's video, I wanted to just dress up with some spring outfits. So these days it is a little bit warmer and I don't know if it's gonna get even warmer. So I thought, why not? Let's look at some spring outfits, just some things I'm really excited to wear for springtime. So let's start off with the first thing. I swear to God, Elby. He just went under my tripod. <laughs> first up are these jeans from Lover's Tide. They are brown. Brown, you always think of that as a tone for fall time. But also at the same time, I'm someone that doesn't really care about like, oh, you're wearing flowers in winter time, but it's like a spring thing. Like, I really don't care about that. I'm just gonna wear something that's gonna make me feel cute, confident, cool, all that stuff. Another thing, honestly, that I'm really excited to wear that and I will be wearing, I feel like with almost every outfit that you're going to see are these freaking boots. A lot of people have asked me like where they can purchase them. I always have it linked in the description box. What I really love about this is that I'm not in a heel, but it's giving me height and that's what I want. <laughs> oh my God. I worked out last night and I think I did like one rep really badly and it messed up my back, which sucks because tonight I'm going to a party, which is why I don't have like a full thing of makeup on right now, but I have to do my face later anyways. So, oh my God, my back. <sighs> what do I do? I mean, honestly, this in itself could be a look. All brown look. Now we're gonna be playing with the brown tones. Do leave it tucked or RuPaul's Drag Race untucked. All right, tucked was the way to go. I am gonna throw on this cardigan, which I wanna style later on also. This is something that I bought when I was in Japan. To be honest, I'm not mad at this. There's yellow on the cardigan. There's some yellow on the button up. I think it goes together. And then we're gonna add in some neutrals. Yeah, I think this is a cute way to tie in a piece. Albie! So these days I've been really into just wearing a lot of brown tones. I end up making my whole outfit kind of brown. And I don't know, I really like it. I think it looks really cool. So now I'm going to be styling this cardigan. All right, so what I was thinking was like, I don't know, maybe picnic, first date kind of look. So I'm hoping it's gonna work. <laughs> We're going to try to tie in more of these browns. So I'm gonna pair it with, of course, a beret. So I have these platform Doc Martin shoes that I actually don't wear a whole lot. And that's a crime because they're really cool. So I'm gonna <laughs> pair it with this outfit. Oh my God, my back, my quits. I like it. So now the black is kind of sticks out maybe a little bit too much. So with that, you can add in a little bit more black accessories. I have a scarf or I can add in pom-pom earrings instead. This guy, oh, what about this one? Oh, I like this. I like this, yes. And this purse is from Ecuador. My mom gifted it to me. Even though it's like different colors and different like prints and stuff, I think it looks really great and it does look cohesive to my eyes. Next thing is we're gonna try to style some of these vests because I have a lot. We'll see what you can do with it because you bought it because you're like, it's so cute. But then girl, what are you wearing it with? Do I go for like colorful or something? Oh, there's like green. It's kind of like Barney colors, actually. Like, can you see that? Guys, we're gonna go full Barney. Oh, this is cute. Boom, boom, boom. All right, I'm going to put on my colorful Reebok sneak, Reebok, Reebok sneakers. Oh my God, dude, I really messed up my back. Can we add in anything else? Accessories, I have my big old purple scrunchie. Meow, meow. Now I also have these gold hoop earrings. I love, I love. I like this. Flowy and like fun. If it had like a shit ton of gold jewelry, it probably would stack a lot of necklaces. Maybe add in some rings. That would just take the look to the next level. I was thinking about styling this. Thrifted in Tokyo. I want the dress to like be the statement. I'm just gonna add like black knee high boots, add in accessories, make it look really fall, but I don't care that I'm wearing it for springtime because it's just clothes. Like just do what you want, right? Just wear what's gonna make you happy. Here's the dress. Uh 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 uh. Gonna wear my brown boots, but I want it to look like classy. Oh my god, my back. I'm gonna go for these black knee high boots that are from Aloha. So a lot of people always ask me like, where are you getting them? Where from Aloha? So I got my affiliate link down below. Click that, you already know. <laughs> On the dress, there are some belt loops. So I think about wearing this orange belt. There's a red orange in the dress. Does that fit? Does that look cute? Newsboy cap. I think it looks good. Yes, 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 yes. Giving me the fantasy. 
I love this look. I love. I think if I were to put something over it, I do have a corduroy blazer that would work. Ooh, yes it does. Yes ma'am. If I were to switch out this blazer for a black one, it's definitely toning down the dress, but because it is this light brown, I think it's just only amplifying the dress even more. So that's what I want. I have a couple dresses that I want to style, but I don't want it to be like dress after dress after dress. So we're going to go with these pants that like, this is like spring. Spring time are these pants. So I have two options. Oh, oh. <laughs> my bad. I normally always wear these, these, these pants with um, this purple top because I feel like they just go so well together. But I could also try this top instead. But I think I'm just gonna go with the tried and true because it complements the pants a little bit more. Cute top. Of course I had to put on flower earrings. I mean like, come on. What shoes to wear? If I wanted to keep it casual, all my back, I could wear these or I could wear my cowboy boots, which is what I normally wear. We are gonna go for the sneakers. Oh wait, what if I wore, is it too much? Is it too much? I think it's just enough. I like it. Yay. These pants are from Kina and Tam. These are from, these are from Find Me Now. I don't know if you could still purchase this, but I think you could still purchase these Kina and Tam ones. Next item is going to be this House of Sunny dress that I absolutely adore. All right, I went for more of a like farm girl kind of vibe. That's why I put on this little head scarf. I don't know what kind of shoes I'm gonna wear, but I do know that it's not gonna be hot enough that I can just wear this like out just like this. So I think adding in a cute cardigan is gonna help me with the vibe that I want. Now, what shoes? I ended up putting on the cowboy boots. Yeah, I always need to add in some height. I added in pom-pom earrings to kind of drive home more of that like muted down green, even though this is a blue, but whatever. I really like this look. Mm. Next is this vest. And I'm gonna see if it's gonna look, hopefully it's not gonna look dumb if I put it over this dress, hopefully. <laughs> Would anyone in their right mind pair this very like business looking vest with this dress? No, I don't mind experimenting. Just the dress and the vest alone. I was like, girl, what in the world? But then I was like, okay, let me just add in a beret. Let me add in some knee high boots. Let's see if that could kind of work. I don't think it looks bad. I could play with color. This could possibly be too much, but great blazer. Looks kind of cute. I like it. I really need to obviously steam this because it, it is crunchy. Kind of giving me like a little bit of like 90s in a way. I don't know. I can't think of like what movie character or show or wore something like this, but I feel like someone in the 90s definitely wore this style. So anyways, I think it looks cool. Finally, we're going to style this dress, but I don't know how much styling I'm actually going to do because I just want to show it off for what it is. It is this gorgeous, gorgeous dress that I thrifted in Tokyo. The brand is Sister Jane. I didn't know how expensive these dresses are. And I did some Google searching and I found this dress is actually retail priced 135 bucks. They were selling it for 1,600 yen. And then when I went to go check out, they're actually having a sale. So I only got it for 1,400 yen. If you were to exchange currencies, maybe like 10 or 11 bucks. A steal! I already am wearing some cute earrings. I really want to wear it with my brown boots because I've already worn this out with my black knee-high boots and I thought that was really cute. I think for this, since like they have the bows up here, having my hair up is best. I love this dress so much. I really don't want to do anything else to it. I could probably add in a belt so it poofs out a little bit more. Okay, let's see how a belt would look like. Since I'm already wearing the brown shoes, let's add in some brown here. Don't really wanna to do too much to it because as I found out when I'm wearing a blazer or something like that, like yeah, these straps definitely get in the way. It makes this really bulky. So I think how I'm gonna to have to wear it is just like regular like this or add in like mock neck or a turtleneck underneath. Ah, this is like the perfect, dress i'm gonna be wearing this dress a whole lot and i don't care because i mean like that's the point of your clothes right you should want to rewear and rewear because you love them so so i was putting on some jeans for the next outfit this dress with jeans she looks cute all right i'm gonna 
change out my earrings, okay? And then black boots, heel boots. I got my freaking back. Ow. Wait, let me check the mirror. <laughs> the black boots were kind of throwing me off, but the cowboy boots though, whoa. Now this is a look. I love this look. I never thought I would be able to wear jeans with a dress because I was like, I'm too short, it doesn't look good. And yeah, I guess because of the length and because it's so poofy, it looks good with jeans. <gasps> Oh my god, I'm so excited to wear it like this. I kind of feel like I'm cheating because I just wore the same bottom. I always do wear this cardigan with like just some jeans and some shoes, but I love wearing little cropped cardigans as shirts. I think it is so freaking cute. You could easily put a crop top underneath this if it's like too hot then you could just like have this open. I added in a pink headband. I would have normally worn my green one, but I was like, let's do a little bit more pink. You guys have seen this look so many times, but it's a look and I like it. Oh well, too bad. <laughs> so, like it. so trying out my pink polka dotted skirt in the last video that I posted up, I was like, you know what, girl, try to see how you can wear this skirt. Have a couple different options. What if we added more polka dots? You have this one. We could try to bring in this shirt from the other outfit that I didn't wear. I thought, what if I just added in just a whole other blue? Granted, it's a sweater, and I know I'm saying like spring outfits, but I mean like, there's some cold days in spring. <laughs> Does this look weird? Hmm. I think this outfit is gonna be a tough one to sell. It looks kind of mismatched, mismatched. But I didn't want to throw in black. Maybe because the blues don't match, it kind of looks a little bit weird. But I think I have the silhouette that I'm going for correct. Are you buying this look? I think adding in the beret and the shoes definitely help. But it's just, yeah, this color, kinda, I don't know. I ended up going a completely different direction. I'm liking it. I'm liking this a lot more. I can sell this to myself a lot more. I think this works better. I tried it with a different um, sweater, but yeah, it's just like the colors weren't matching up. This, even though the colors aren't matching up, I'm like, oh, look who woke up. Come on in. Oh, you like my outfit? Yeah, thank you. I don't want to have to wear black because this is already a lot of black and there's only like a little bit of color. Like the pink one, it's like there's a lot more pink. It doesn't feel like it's completely drowning it out. But if I were to wear black with this, I feel like, I don't know. This I don't mind and I definitely would still rock this out. Is this very spring? Hell no. I don't know what this is, but I'm really excited to wear this skirt because I got it during the winter time. I wasn't able to wear it during the winter time and summertime, there's no way I'm going to be wearing this. I'm going to try to do the best I can. Our last item is this dress that I thrifted last summer, but I didn't get a chance to uh, thrift it last summer. No, I thrifted it like last, last summer. Wow. I don't know, but I threw it at some point. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely more of a summer dress because it's so light, but I'm thinking because it's brown, I could probably pair it with my brown boots, maybe add in a blazer, and then make it a little bit more springy. Cute. Dun, 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 dun. Oh my God, it's been such a long time since I have seen my freaking jean jacket. I was gonna wear a blazer, but then I saw my jean jacket and I was like, yes, yes, yes giving me 90s kind of grungy vibes. So, yay! Oh my God, I'm so excited to wear this out. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, homies. This was just like a little preview of what I am going to be wearing for springtime. I'm definitely gonna try to go out more so I could just like wear more outfits, even if it's just me, myself, and I is all I got in the end. And maybe with Albie. But anyways, I will catch you guys in the next one, homies. Thank you so much for watching. Remember, stay blessed and not stressed. Bye! Albie, come! You guys say goodbye. Don't be disrespectful. You got manners. Albie, look right here. Good boy. Boy, boy. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye.